Hi, my name is Amar. In this video, I will discuss about string side menu in Flutter using GetX. As you can see in the output, if I click here, then this is the string side menu. How to achieve this? That portion I will discuss today. Here, I have created this project by using the Get CLI tool. After creating the project in the pubspec.yml file, I have taken this string side menu dependency. Now, let me move to home view. In the home view, you can see in the build method, I have written the side menu widget. This is provided by the plugin which we have taken in the pubspec.yml file. In the type, we can specify the side menu type, right? Here I have used slide and rotate. If I press dot here, then you can find different types of side menu, right? Now in the child, I have used scaffold. In the scaffold, I have used the app bar and in the title, I have given the title as string side menu, which you can see here. Now in the leading, I have used the icon button and in the icon, I have used icons.menu. Now whenever this icon will be pressed at that time, the side menu will be opened or closed. That code I will write later on. After that in the body, I have taken a center widget and in the text, I have a specified side menu which is visible here, right? And in the menu property of side menu, I have called this build menu function. In the build menu function which is returning a widget, as you can see here I have written a single child scroll view I have given a padding and in the child I have used the column widget and in the column widget I have used different li uh, list style children's as you can see here right so whenever I am clicking here all these menus are visible as you can see home profile wallet all these options or menus are visible now how to close and how to open the side menu that portion I will discuss for that I will move to home controller in the home controller I need to write the code here I am writing final global key and here I will use side menu state which is provided by the plugin after that here I will give a name as side menu key equals to now let me write here global key sorry global key and its type will be let me just copy and paste it here fine now after that what i will do here i will create a function let uh, the function be void open close side menu and inside this function i will write if side menu key dot current state dot is opened if it is opened then what will happen i need to close the side menu and to close the side menu i need to write side menu key dot current state dot close side menu right and if it is not opened then i need to open this and to do that i will simply copy it paste it here and instead of close side menu here i will use open side menu and i need to call this function from this on pressed method right so here i will write controller dot open close side menu once you write this code after that if you click here then the side menu will open and if you click here then the side menu will be closed this is how we can achieve string side menu in Flutter using GetX. I hope you have liked my video. If you have liked my video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.